World Heritage Sites represent the treasures of humankind in many ways. These locations hold immense cultural value, that must be preserved at all costs. The lust for power, however, knows no bounds and has ended up damaging a host of these renowned landmarks. Oh my god. Oh the my devastation god. has been centered in conflict zones, where neighboring countries, radical groups, or terror organizations wreak havoc, and show no compassion. Today, we take a look at the before and after states of heritage sites, that have come in the crosshairs of dangerous environments. Number one on our list is Palmyra, Syria. Known as the Pearl of the Desert, Palmyra was a gem in its prime. This monumental city dates back to the Mesopotamian era. And through the years, Palmyra was conquered by many rulers and dynasties, including the Romans who held it for more than five centuries. The city's architecture is marked by these conquests, which defined grandeur and provided an invaluable glimpse into the first age of man. The Temple of Bel, and the Great Colonnade, were prominent attractions that have since lost their charm due to conflict and bombardment. The Islamic State, or ISIS, seized control of Palmyra in 2011, and caused widespread destruction to prominent statues in the years that followed. While a few structures, still exist, most of Palmyra's glory is now part of the rubble. At number 2, comes one of the world's first global cities, the Syrian capital, Aleppo. This war-torn city was once ruled by the Romans and Greeks, at different junctures, but the Ottoman era of Aleppo, was the finest in its history, with most of its monuments and heritage sites built during that time. The Ayyubid and Mamluks, also ruled this place for a brief period, leaving behind a lasting impression that attracted thousands of tourists for many decades. Built on natural limestone, and rising over 100 feet, the citadel of Aleppo was a sight to behold and preserved, by every ruler. The Syrian civil war, however changed everything, as the raging conflict obliterated the foundations of the entire city. Famous sites like the Umaway Mosque, the Hammam al Nahasan Bath House, and the Al Zarab Souk were reduced to nothing more than ruins. According to official numbers, more than 150 heritage buildings were damaged in the four year long battle between the government and opposition forces. Third on our list is Nimrud, Iraq. Although Iraqi forces overtook the city back in 2015, its soul had been long destroyed by the Islamic State militants. The radical group did everything they could to damage the rich heritage, and historical statues of the site. The city was founded more than 3,000 years ago, and was one of the capitals of the Assyrian Empire. It flourished in the reign of King Asher Nasir Pal, the second. The Assyria ruler shifted the capital from Asher to Nimrud, which brought the city under the spotlight. Beautiful palaces, and towers were erected made from the finest stones, and made Nimrud a city of wonder. It remained glorious for much of the modern era, until it was forcefully turned to rubble. Bandiagra, Mali, takes the number 4 spot on our list. Based in the Mopti region of Mali, Bandiagra is a traditional, yet majestic site home to remarkable landscapes. 
The Cliff of Bandiagra, also known as Land of the Goblins, is the biggest attraction that houses 289 diverse villages in it. Since the Paleolithic times, humans have inhabited Bandiagra, with the natural rock formations, acting as a natural shield against hostile invaders. Besides the Dobbins, Bandiagra is also home to groups like the Bozo, Sonrai, Bambara, and Pules, all of whom have their own practices and rituals. It had been smooth sailing for many centuries, until the events of 2012, endangered the heritage site. Armed groups began looting villages, and destroyed invaluable buildings and objects in the area. The once dominant ethnic groups vanished from Bandiagra, which suddenly became a dangerous environment that fostered violence instead of peace. Hebron, Palestine takes the fifth spot. Declared as a World Heritage Site just three years ago, Hebron is one of the four holiest cities, in both Judaism, and Islamic tradition. Abraham, who is recognized as the messenger of God in Islam, is said to have lived in Hebron, making it a huge pilgrimage site. The Crusaders, Mamluks, and Ottoman Turks ruled over the land in different periods, with excavations also pointing to the presence of Arabs. The tomb of the patriarchs is the star attraction, with the town also rich in Ottoman architecture, that dominates the many households here. Hebron's magnificence however, is constantly shrouded by the tense state of affairs in Palestine. The Israelis always have an eye out, and didn't hide their annoyance after Hebron, was recognized as a heritage site in 2017. Russia's invasion into Ukraine, has disrupted peace and harmony in the country. Several people are fleeing the land to neighboring countries, most leaving some family, and belongings behind. While Ukraine is bravely fighting off the Russian military, there are several casualties, including destruction of historical and cultural monuments. One such being, the Bobinya Monument. This cultural statue, was commemorated to honor the 34,000 Jewish victims that were massacred by the Nazi troops in 1941. Other cultural sites, like Ivankov Historical, the local history museum, were also struck by Russian missiles and destroyed. They held some of the most renowned works of art by Ukrainian folk artist, Maria Primashenko. It's unfortunate to witness such sacred places fall prey to petty disputes and unprovoked violence. But we can always hope that these iconic locations will reclaim a part of their old charm in the days to come.